Hey creative, what's up? It's your girl Jamila and welcome back to my laboratory. One of the questions I get pretty often about supplementation shirts is do they have to be white? Do they have to be 100% polyester? Or can you sublimate on black? So today we're going to go ahead and experiment on a couple different Bella Canvas shirts that are different colors and have varying amounts of polyester in them and see what we get. I'll have everything I use that's in the description box below. And if you like this video, you learned something new, make sure you give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and make sure that bell notification's on so you don't miss any of my upcoming craft tutorials. To test out different colors and see how they look on each blank, we're gonna be using this color wheel. So the first T I'm gonna go ahead and press is the 3830 unisex T from the Bella Canvas website. And I'm gonna go ahead and press the color wheel at the usual temperature at 400 degrees for 60 seconds. And I got this color wheel image from Jennifer Maker's website. And of course, I'll have all the links in the description box of this video. So this t-shirt is 65% polyester, which basically means it's only gonna hold 65% of in the ink once it's pressed and as you can see it presses well but the image is just not that bright the ink looks kind of dull the next shirt we're using is this 3650 poly cotton tee in the stone marble color and again i'm going to press it at 400 degrees for 60 seconds this shirt is 91% polyester, so I knew the colors would be bright, but I was actually pleasantly surprised on how bright they were on this colored shirt. Now, Bella Canvas does have a white shirt in this style color with the 91% polyester count, but at the time of this video, it was out of stock, so I wasn't able to test that for you guys, but I already know it would make an awesome sublimation shirt just based off of that one. And this shirt as well is a 91% polyester count, but it's in a different color. And you know, Bella Canvas has such a wide variety of shirts, so many colors. You can literally just go through the website. And I just read the product description to see which shirt would be best for sublimation. And of course, with their new Makers Account program, you can get your wholesale blanks without needing a resale certificate. And I just went ahead and sublimated on something all black for you guys, just because people always ask, can you sublimate on black? So if you're new to sublimation and you want to know if you can sublimate on black or what happens if you do, these are the results you get, okay? Nothing. <laughs> you cannot sublimate directly onto black so if you love bella canvas like i do and wondered if they had some shirts for sublimation i dec definitely recommend the 3650 style and the stone marble or their speckle white or even the blue shirt if you just want to go ahead and do like a black design it'll show up really well and these are what the shirts look like after i washed and dried them as you can see the white faded even more after being washed but the other style held up. So I hope this video was helpful. Let me know in the comments. As always, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And until next time, I'll see you later.